As I go back and I think about my fondest memories and the things that are very, very close to me, close to my heart, what it really comes down to is my teammates. And it's been like 23, 24 years since I actually played competitively and I still keep in contact with certain guys, and especially guys I played with in college. And when we get together, we talk about all kinds of things and, and we reminisce sometimes. We do not reminisce about statistics. We don't reminisce about how many you know, catches or yards somebody got in the game. We talk about the fun times that we had together. Fun times that we had in practice, like funny stories, funny things that happened in practice, things that happened on road trips, funny things coaches did. You're spending quality time with people that you care about, people that you trust. And you care about those people and you trust those people more than anybody else because of the trials and the tribulations and the struggles that you've gone through together. It's the difficult parts of football that bring you together, if you can hang in there. Championship football, the, the maverick way, commitment, hard work, a physical mindset, starts in the weight room, fundamentals, attention to detail, preparation, focusing on the inner game, in here and in here, competitive attitude, and a hunger to be the best. Communication between coaches and players, between players and players about anything and everything. And finally about being a servant leader. Okay, and that's where it comes back to your buddies and your teammates. And so all those things I've listed, we have done those things. We have sacrificed. We have prepared. We've worked our collective tails off. And now we're getting to the second half of the season where we are trying to take the next step to become an elite team, not a good team, an elite team. And I think about some of the best teams we've had, we've done all those things I listed, but the very, very best teams we've had have been super close, have been super tight. Like the team chemistry was just on point. And our state championship team where we won it all, we did not figure that out until the playoffs. I can remember the day it happened where it clicked and it was the secret sauce for us that took us to the next level. The secret sauce that what makes us different than everybody else. And I'm gonna tell you what that is. When you care more about the well-being of your teammate and how well your teammate does above and beyond how you do individually, that's when magic happens. When it's all about the team. When you find joy in seeing your buddy, your brother, have success. That's what it's about. It's about us, together. And I'm telling you, you believe that in your heart of hearts, you buy into that, nothing's stopping us. Because we've done all those other things. But people don't have the heart we have. People don't come together like we have. They haven't faced the adversity we have. They haven't worked like we have worked. They don't have the history and the culture and the tradition that we have. And you got three opportunities left in the regular season to get it done. Starts tonight, it's a division game, it's about the postseason, it's about setting the tone for the rest of the year. Let's go!